Happy New Year, my loves! You're welcome back to my channel. My name is Mimi, and I do hope you enjoy today's video. Hold on a second, guys. In today's video, we're going cafe hopping in Accra. I happen to find myself in the East Ligon area, so I decided why not try out some cafes that I've never been. Hopefully, they have some good food because I'm starving, and of course, some great ambience too. Hey guys i got a new microphone and i'm testing it out so there's a lot of noise there's a lot of music playing in the background but it's so packed but this is a very nice coffee shop i didn't expect it to be this busy the first thing i tried which is this coffee they call it the kaneshi and it's so good guys currently waiting for my food i ordered the breakfast in a pan and so when that comes, I'll show you guys what that looks like as well. They make their own coffee. They grow their own coffee bean. And it's so good. I'm not a coffee drinker, but this is nice. I love it. I specifically told them that I wouldn't want anything that's so bitter because I'm not a coffee drinker. So they made me something that is on the sweet side. Perfect. Guys, I could come here every single day of my life. I'd like to thank. Look. <gasps> so dope. And I think it's suspending with, you know, the aid of some strings. I really think this is made out of clay. See guys, the reading is very important because of the wall, it gives an illusion that you can actually climb on the staircase, but you really cannot because this has nothing supporting it. And that is the wall. So this is the actual thing. Crazy. Not me thinking I could go upstairs. My time at Nobrike Foundation was really great. I don't know why we don't visit these places a lot more often, especially because this one in particular, guys, is free. So I don't know why the place was so empty. It's like nobody even knows about the place. There's currently an exhibition going on by an artist called Halima Idrisu. I think her exhibition is till the end of March. So you guys don't miss out on this nice exhibition she's using her work to throw light on women in the muslim community and she used henna and paint in her work it's just really nice i don't want to give too much away but you should check them out i'll leave a link to their instagram page down in the description box below another thing they do every friday is have students from all over you know various schools come around and then they have a reading club or a book session where the kids learn to read and just learn you know and enjoy reading and i think it's very important and it brought back so many memories because when i was doing miss malika ghana my project was centered around reading it was called books for change so when i saw that i was like wow this is really cool so i was like you know what who's going back there me so every friday or any friday if i find that i have time on my hands after 3 30 that's when it happens i'm going to pop by and just assist the children in reading if you're free you can come by that'll be interesting as well and on the issue of no videos no photos it has a lot to do with 
the more professional cameras. So your phone is fine. Sir, please, where's the elevator? Do I have to go straight? Okay, all right, thank you. All right, you guys, so Quiet Cafe is in this beautiful building called Volta Place or Palace. Did I read that, Will? Thank you. I nearly missed my way. I honestly thought this space was in East Legon, but apparently it is not. It gets so confusing, guys. Oh, I'm so sorry. Okay, this one is open. Let's just get in here. And be out of And get home. Oh, oh my days. Nice to Oh, where's your boy? Oh, yeah, that's okay. Wow. So when you said carrot cake, it was actually a flavor. Yeah. I thought I thought you meant carrot cake, carrot cake. No. Oh wow. And this is my specialist green tea. Hi guys, this is Quiet Terrace. Oh my god, I hope the audio will be good enough. I don't really want to shout because it's a cafe. There are people here actually working. And there are people that come here for the solitude, so you don't want to disturb people. But I really thought this cafe was in East Legon. It was after I hit the road that I realized that it was not, but it's not too far from East Legon. It took me about 11 minutes to get here and it's so beautiful. One of the reasons why I wanted to try out this cafe is because they have books behind me that you can read or buy if you're interested in that. And also, I wanted to have some really good hummus. I saw it on the menu and I was like, oh, I would love to try that. And I'm also having some tea. I don't know the type of tea, but they made me choose some tea that comes with ginger, lemon, um, honey. Very healthy tea, you know. So we're doing that with the hummus and pita bread. And I also have me a book here. I picked it up from this shelf. It's called Same Elephants by this author right here. And... I doubt I'll be able to finish this book, but till my order comes in, which is my food, I'll be reading this. So let's do that. The environment is very serene. It's very, very peaceful. And I love the choice of music. It's very relaxing. It gives it that cafe vibes, obviously. So let's do this. <laughs> I need to speak very fast because my battery is running low but this is amazing it's so delicious the hummus is so creamy and battery so nice the beef is spicy it adds a kick to it so good and my tea guys this is good all right guys Thank you so much for watching my videos. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next one. Hopefully I give you an update because today I don't have my charger here so that's going to be impossible to continue this video. But next time I see you guys, I'll give you an update. Bye! Look at the view from the restaurants in the evening. Isn't this so pretty?
think this is so beautiful. It's like a 360 view of a car. So dope.